Hey everyone, Evil Spirit here. And you know, today I decided I was gonna record myself playing some uh, TF2. I ain't the so this is kind of like uh, post recording. Uh, I'm obviously going to be a little bit more relaxed and talk about stuff. Um, and why I decided I was gonna record myself playing it. Um, if you don't know, I have. Um, um, I have not played, uh, TF2 for, like, about seven months now. I have, um, I haven't really had a reason to go back to it. Um, so basically, I have not played it for that long, and I decided I was gonna just test it out, especially because Overwatch 2's coming out, and I don't have any plans on getting my hands on it, because, uh, I, I just don't have a good reason to. I'm not really into, like, how the game, I guess, kind of presents itself. So, I decided I was going to record myself playing this. I decided not to have my audio on, and this is going, hopefully, on Evil Spirit Gaming. And if that's the case, then, yeah, you know, obviously. Also, I don't know if I'm ever going to really do this again. Um, because, if you don't know, TF2... Um, a lot of people use it for commentary videos, but I, um, I never did. I use, like, different games, like, especially if, like, I'm talking about a game, like my Resident Evil Village video, I was talking on, uh, what was it? I was talking about it, and I played Resident Evil Village on the video, and sometimes I'll edit it, but... <sighs> you know, I'm not gonna lie, uh, I actually got a comment, uh, today, actually, uh, my final episode of Metal Gear Solid 3 went up, so that's cool, I'm glad that did go up, it's been a while since I played, uh, Metal Gear Solid 3, uh, been like almost a month since I got done and beat it, so I guess I could just, you could tell how long that's been in the works, um, I'm thinking about Maybe I'll sit down and play some Metal Gear Solid uh, Peace Walker, maybe. But anyhow, um, I recently seen uh, Metal Gear Solid... Um, I got a Metal Gear Solid comment about the third game. And basically, they said, I'm basically playing it in order. And if you're watching this video, hi. Sorry, the quality of the gameplay ain't the best. I had to use a different screen recorder I can't use uh OBS it just didn't work I don't know but um yeah I was like he said basically he's glad that I'm not doing it out of order you know like playing Metal Gear Rising because you know a lot of people want to play it for um uh, a lot of people want to play Metal Gear Rising because Senator Armstrong's a character and I understand that and I have played Metal Gear Rising uh but I kind of already had a good idea of the story. I played other Metal Gear games before I played Metal Gear Rising. I played the Phantom Pain a bit, and I played um, the first one a bit. I didn't beat the first one. I had like a good like three hours in it, maybe. Um, I'm on the. I was on like the uh, uh, Raven fight, I believe, the one in the tank. First time you fight him, and uh, you know that's where I kind of stopped playing. But anyways. Uh, other than that, though, you know, I know people play games out of order, and that triggers, and that kind of, like, ticks people off. I, it ticks me off, too, don't get me wrong. Uh, for example, uh, originally, I was going to do Metal Gear Solid 1, or Metal Gear Rising, but I decided to start with 3 and record that, and then play Rising, I mean, not Rising, uh, then play Peace Walker, and then go from there. The only game I really don't think I'll get to right now is five because it has ground zeros and the phantom pain and i don't want to sit down and play through technically 57 hours of content because uh metal gear solid uh well i guess 50 hours because metal gear five uh metal gear solid five the phantom pain is 45 hours and metal gear solid um Ground Zeroes is like five hours, I think. I don't know. I haven't played it. Um, I don't really plan on playing through the Phantom Pain or uh, or 
five, really. Uh, uh, like, just any of five. From what I heard, the story ain't that great. And that's kind of what I like about Metal Gear, is the story. So, yeah, I guess my next plan would be I'll sit down and play through Metal Gear Solid 5, and then just kind of see how that all goes from there. Um, or not Metal Gear. I'll play Peace Walker, and I'll see if I want to play... I, I'm also debating if I want to even play, like, the original, original Metal Gear Solid games. The Metal Gear games, I guess. Because Metal Gear, Metal Gear 1 and Solid Snake is, like, I hear a lot of people say it's very dated, and I don't really need to play them. But I don't know. It just really depends. And if I don't do 5, I'll, I guess I'll just do Metal Gear Solid 1, then 2, and then 4 and Rising, which... I'm kind of excited to see what 4 is all about. I hear a lot of differing opinions on 4. <sighs> I don't know, though. Uh, uh, what else can I talk about, really? I mean, I guess I'm working on my next Let's Play. I've kind of been wanting to beat Undertale. Which, once I'm done with Pacifist, I'm going to kind of wait a bit till I do Genocide Route. And then, maybe that'll be like 2023. Maybe I'll get to it. I don't know. Um, and Metal, uh, now, other than Undertale, uh, I also have Mega Man 11, which hopefully I'll be done with it in no time. I just have this going up because, honestly, I just kind of want to give myself a little bit more time before I can go into another game. Which, I've been debating, like, what would be, like, my next Let's Play after, um, uh, Mega Man 11 and Undertale. And, in my opinion, I think it might be Pikmin 3. But that, but that's another thing of, like... People would probably be like, where's Pikmin 1 and 2? And I, I understand that, definitely. Especially because I kind of had that problem of, I played, um, for example, I played uh, Metroid Fusion. If I went straight to Metroid, uh, if I went straight to Metroid Prime, I don't think a lot of people would be upset. But if I went to, like, say, Metroid Dread, a lot of people are going to be like, why didn't you play Metroid... Uh, Super Metroid or Metroid Fusion, which I, I don't know if I'm even going to do Metroid 2. I don't, I don't really want to go through AM2R. It's not like it's a bad game or anything. I just don't play a lot of PC games. Like, oh, well, that's kind of ironic because I'm playing TF2 in the footage, but still. Uh, there's still, like, a, a few other games I want to kind of get myself through. Uh, I want to get through, like, you know, maybe a Final Fantasy game, but I, I got a lot more game ideas that I need to sit down. I'm about to go through another replay session in December. My next guess is I'm going to sit down and replay uh, Mario Odyssey, but that really just depends on who would really want to see me play through Mario Odyssey again. Which, I mean, I'm different now than I was back then. Maybe a lot of people would like to see it. Maybe a lot of people wouldn't. I don't really blame you if you're either way. Maybe I'll play, like, a football game. Because, uh, like, the last one I played was, like, Madden 25, or 25th Anniversary, which we're about to come up on Madden 25, actually. I wonder how people are going to react to that. Is it going to be called Madden 25? or Because it's their 24th year, or not, because it's been 25 years since the first Madden game in, that, uh, in 2014. So are they going to do 35 years, like Mario 35? Probably. I don't know. It just depends, I guess. Uh, there's like a few other games I've been debating about doing a playthrough of, um, like, other than just Metroid or something like that, you know. It makes you wonder. There's also like a few other games I wanted to do a playthrough of, but I don't know if I have enough time now with Final Fantasy VII Remake. Maybe I'll sit down and do that. Maybe I'll do, uh, RPG. Maybe I'll do Skyrim. Oh, gosh. I don't know. I don't know about Skyrim, but... I'll get to a game, I promise. Um, I know I played Wii. I played uh, Big Brain Academy not too long ago. I mean, like, yesterday, I guess, but... You, get, you can't blame me. I really wanted to record me playing that because... Honestly, just to show how stupid I am, I guess. I'm kind of looking at my shelf right now, and I'm kind of debating on... What would be a good game to play through. Been looking at Minecraft Xbox 360 edition, seeing maybe if you guys would like that, I'll do it. Obviously, I won't just be like, no, I just wanted to see so that I could be a jerk. Maybe I'll do that, actually. Maybe I'll play Minecraft Xbox 360 edition. That'd be a very weird playthrough, though, because a lot of people are so used to this new style. I mean, honestly, I got kind of used to it. 
Uh, but maybe I'll play Xbox 360 Edition and see which one's the better version. Maybe. I don't know. I played Wii U Edition back in 2019. And in my opinion, that's still one of my favorite Let's Plays i ever done. Because although a lot of people would say that my newer stuff is probably better. I don't know. I, I think Minecraft Wii U Edition... Like, just a fun excuse to just play Minecraft. Especially because I like that edition, too. Minecraft. Because, like, I have, like, five editions of Minecraft. Uh, I got 3DS edition. Uh, new 3DS edition. Uh, Wii U edition. Xbox 360 version. Uh, Bedrock. And then, uh, Java. I haven't really played too much of Java to really consider it a better version. Or, above all, you know, uh... Because I, I know a lot of people would say that Bedrock is for multiplayer, and a lot of people say Java is for hardcore, but I don't know, really. And a lot of people could say maybe I should do a video covering all, like, the versions of Minecraft, but you guys... Oh, I also have a P PS3 edition. I don't know how much different that is, but who knows? Maybe it's, like, the most differing version. I know there's also Switch edition, but that's just uh, Bedrock. 3DS edition is actually kind of different. There's like a lot of things. Like the last update was before like the what? Uh, I think even before the Pillager update. I don't know. It came out 2018 or 2017 around that time. Uh, but who knows? Maybe I'll do a playthrough of all. Uh, maybe I'll do like a hardcore playthrough. But I don't know. Uh, I got like. I looked at my game collection actually yesterday because I had to clean it up because it just looked like weird. And I looked at Control and I was like, maybe I should play Control again because I tried doing Control. It just, you know, it didn't work out, but maybe people would like Control. But, who knows? Who knows, really? Who knows, knows, you know? So we're about to get to the wrap up of this video because who. Who would have guessed I freaking talk for 13 minutes and 11 seconds? Or almost 13 minutes and 11 seconds. But, you know, this is how normally the cookie crumbles. I gotta end it sometime, but. Yeah, I'll definitely, like, kind of keep an eye out on the next Let's Play. If you see another video like this, let me know how well you like them. Because, honestly, I, I would definitely do another one of these. These are just kind of fun to do, sit down and talk, not have to worry about the game, not really paying attention to the game right now, so you get, you're just really hearing me talk, this is kind of a commentary video, but yeah, I mean, that's really it for me over here on the YouTube cycle, uh, thank you all for watching, and have a good night, bye.